हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू अप्लाइड फॉरेंसिक रिसर्च साइंसेज माई नेम इज़ दिव्या पोरवाल आई एम मेम्बर ऑफ अप्लाइड फॉरेंसिक रिसर्च साइंसेज इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू कवर द टॉपिक पेपर इलेक्ट्रोफॉरिसिस सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द फर्स्ट द मीनिंग ऑफ इलेक्ट्रोफॉरिसिस इलेक्ट्रोफॉरिसिस इज इंटरप्रिटेड एज द माइग्रेशन ऑफ चार्ज पार्टिकल्स थ्रू अ सोल्यूशन अंडर द इम्पैक्ट ऑफ आउटर इलेक्ट्रिकल स्पेस आयन्स दैट आर कैंसल्ड बिटवीन टू इलेक्ट्रोड वर्क टू ट्रैवल टूवर्ड्स द इलेक्ट्रोड दैट अज्यूम अपोजिट चार्जेस डिपेंडिंग ऑन द काइंड ऑफ चार्जेस द मॉलिक्यूल्स कैरी दे मूव टूवर्ड आइदर टू कैथोड और एनोड एंड द इलेक्ट्रोफॉरिसिस इज Uh, I have many types, but some types are gel electrophoresis, hemoglobin electrophoresis, protein DNA, etc. Then paper electrophoresis. Paper electrophoresis is the separation technique mainly used for separation of amino acids, proteins, peptides, etc. Separation of mixture is based on charge on sample molecule. In this technique, migration of charged particles take place through a paper. Uh, is a support medium under influence of electric field particles molecules with the unnet positive charge cations move toward the cathode while those with net negative charge anions migrate toward the anode next is procedure paper is used as support medium in this technique wattman pa- filter paper grade 3 mm or number 1 are generally used in paper electrophoresis Width of the paper is two point five to five centimeter, with suitable length so that both ends of paper strip should touch the buffer solution. Prior to use, paper is washed with distilled water, followed by zero point one m HCl or zero point zero one m EDTA to remove impurities. Types of paper electrophoresis based on voltage applied are. first low voltage and second high voltage which we will discuss in the different video working of paper electrophoresis types of electrophoresis based on design of instrument are first horizontal second vertical third continuous so let's start with first horizontal paper electrophoresis as shown in the diagram there are two buffer tanks are present which are connected with glass plate holding paper buffer tanks are filled with buffer solution and electrode and anode are dip into the buffer tank both anode and cathode cathode are present in different or opposite uh, buffer tank and a filter paper strip is Uh, set in the particular position that the end of the strip are dipped in the buffer tank then the sample is put on the particular filter paper strip in the between of it and uh, on the uh, in the form of round shape or in the form of strip or line shape after put the sample on filter paper strip it is covered with a safety cover and the cathode and anode uh, connect with the battery after that the current will flow in the electrode and anode voltage then the sample was migrate or start migrating molecules of sample are migrate toward anode to cathode or cathode to anode after the completion of separation the filter strip is dried then it removed from the particular instrument electrophoresis instrument vertical paper electrophoresis is the same as horizontal paper electrophoresis but the difference is in the instead of a horizontal plate there are three rods are present which hold the paper vertically as shown in the figure and after placing the paper safety cover is placed continuous paper electrophoresis in this uh, diagram as you shown that buffer solutions are present in the two ends and the uh, particular horizontal uh, glass plate is present in the horizontal direction and sample components are placed in many uh, quantities so that the process of electrophoresis is in continuous form so many samples are worked on a particular electrophoresis instrument 
that's all for this video thank you